Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. Um, I am in my car and I'm here doing laundry. It's one of my days off and um, got a lot of things that I need to tackle from my to-do list. But the reason why I'm doing this video is because today I'm going to be tackling a project that I've been really excited to take on. Um, and it is going to be for the patio garden space. So I'm going to just kind of give you a quick to-do list that I need to get done for today. So I went ahead and ordered some um, mosquito netting. So I'm going to have to sew the curtains together. Um, and I kind of started already last night sewing some of those um, curtains together and today I have to finish. I also have to paint under the pergola. I'm going to go ahead and paint like everything and that's going to be green and white. Um, just like the house is then I have got some velcro to put up so I have to put that up um, I have to I took down the lights last night and I have to put up the lights back again um, also we have one of those light sockets that somebody took out when they were coming in and doing the various things around the house that we had to fix up and so <laughs> nobody ever put that back um, and we're trying to put that back so that can bring in more light um, to the space but I have no idea how to do that and so yeah that's gonna be interesting trying to figure out how to do that um, and then yeah I guess the other thing is like try to declutter a little bit more um, see what we can get rid of today and just get that space looking beautiful Hello, so I just got one of the other things that I needed to build my mosquito net. Um, it's one yard and I'm going to show you in the video what I'm going to do, but I'm going to be cutting out a piece of this. I'm thinking about two inches, an inch to get in the Velcro in there and get it sewn up onto the space. So let's go ahead and take a look.
All right, hello everyone. It is about to be 5 p.m. and I've made no progress. Um, I tackled the roof here and I only got this part done before I ran out of paint. And so then I started working on sewing, but then my mom came home with my grandma and then they're like, oh, let's go to the store, let's do things. And then we went to the store to buy paint but we just got back because of course we took forever looking at things um, but I just wanted to show you it is a mess in here and hopefully it'll look good by the end of the project this is what everything looks like everything is messed up the Sun is going down didn't get to declutter anything and yeah it's just not not good so I'm just gonna open up the new paint start working on that do this at night when I can't see and paint anymore so let's go Good morning, good morning. It is gonna be 8 a.m. almost and it is cold, uh, but I need to continue with the painting because I'm gonna finish this project this weekend. Um, I have to, I have to. Anyways, yeah, I'm out here. I got out of bed, it is freezing and yeah i gotta continue painting all of this so my plan of attack is to finish doing all the inside and then i will tackle the outside um so yeah let's go ahead and do that All right, so it's about to be 9.30 and I ran out of green paint and I still have some that I need to paint. Uh, but I do have somebody coming to give me an estimate for the trash so that they can, we can finally clean out our yard. Um, so I can't really leave to go buy new paint. So I'm gonna go ahead and tackle a different project. And let's see if you can see it is this sticky black hook and loop tape roll so this is sticky and then the part that velcros onto it so the idea is that the sticky velcroy part will be up on the um, banister and then the other part will be sewn on to the fabric so that i can take it down and take put it back up whenever i need to that's more like the summer slash winter
hello everyone i am a mess but i wanted to do a check-in and oh my goodness i'm sweaty and dirty and oh no um anyways i wanted to do a check-in before my phone dies because everything just died um and show you the progress that we so here is what everything looks like obviously i have to declutter um and i didn't buy enough fabric to cover the entire pergola so i miss measured so i need something for here and that corner area there but other than that everything else is up um, i just need to go around and sew little rocks in between so that it's down and not in about um, the other thing is here it's a little too high so i need to figure out if i'm gonna sew more fabric underneath just to cover that little height difference or what i want to do i'm also thinking maybe just cutting this piece out here and moving that over there and then just buying something here that's the actual length of that or maybe investing in an actual door magnet thing i'm not sure yet so i have to think about it um but yeah so what right now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna start putting the lights up so here are the lights that were there before here are the ones that i had in the center and i ordered new lights solar lights here so we'll hopefully get those up all over this pergola so that it's nice and cute and lastly i have to sweep everything and clean everything but i just wanted to show that since i know my phone's gonna die hello hello it is saturday it is 4 p.m and it's been about a week since i started this project up here obviously you can see there's some touch-ups i need to do and mainly back there there is a lot <laughs> that needs to be done um, and if you remember oh well i guess you'll see it in the video because it'll be one video but this is not long enough and then we didn't have enough to go over there and this place is still a mess so today right now my package just arrived which means i can finally tackle this project and it is more uh net 
it is more mosquito netting so I'll be able to tackle it and I'm gonna go ahead and start with this side over here just to make sure that the length is correct and good and ready to go and once that's good we'll tackle this little part I've made it to the part where I need to declutter that much. 